Wa alfa en omega we worship you our lord you are worthy to be praised you are alpha and omega we worship you our lord you are worthy to be praised we give you to be praised we give you all the glory we worship you our lord you are worthy to be praised we give you all the glory we worship you our lord you are worthy to be praised we give you all the glory worship you our lord you are worthy to be praised we give you all the glory we worship you our lord you are worthy to be praised. Praise the Lord, the brothers and the sisters everywhere you are in all four corners of uh, uh, this world. Mm. I greet you in the name of Lord Christ Jesus of Nazareth. I'm your friend, Prophet Alfonso Warali Chris. I'm here. Uh, this is the right time to share the word of God with you. The beautiful message. I'm praying you to continue sharing this message. Forward the message to other brothers and sisters outside there. And the God will continue to bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Blessing you. God will continue blessing you. Blessing you. Thank you. Thank you so very much, my fellow friends. I love you. I love you. Mm. We will find our message from the book of Titus. Titus chapter 1, chapter 1, chapter 1. Mm. Let me look here. Mm. Beautiful verse. Uh, verse 15 uh, and the verse 16. We're going to read the two verses. Uh, let's hear this message. What is saying to all of us now? To the pure, all things are pure, but uh, to those who are corrupted and do not believe, nothing is pure. In fact, both their minds and their conscience are corrupted. They claim to know God, uh, but uh, their actions, they deny Him. They are detestable, uh, disobedience, and unfit for doing anything good. Praise the Lord, the brothers and the sisters, everywhere you are in all four corners of the world. To the pure, everything are pure. 
to those are not pure, nothing is pure with them. Praise the Lord, brothers and sisters. Ah, beautiful message, beautiful message, dear brothers and sisters. Let's continue praising God. To the pure, everything is pure. We got two category of uh, people here that we're talking about. They are those that are pure and the others who are not pure. Two categories of people. You'll set yourself at your right place where you are among the pure people or the and pure people it's your a choice your choice choose today where you are you see where you are it's a matter of decision you're gonna decide yourself to the pure everything are pure to this one that are defiled, nothing is pure. The one that are dirty, nothing is pure. To be dirty in the eyes of God is just when you're still doing wrong things. Look, the scripture is telling me and you here. Nothing is pure, in fact. Both their mind and conscience are corrupted. Nothing is pure. So these that are defiled, nothing is pure. They claim to know God, but say they deny God by their evil actions. You're going to claim to know God and you're still in the wrong doing. Two things. God and the wrong doings. You see now how things oppose itself. You claim to know God at one side and you're still bewitching people. The fact that you're still bewitching people, you deny God already. It means... You don't know God. You can't know God. You will mean to know him and you're still doing wrong, as I said. Bewitching people here. Your claim is I know God. The other side, you're still bewitching people. The action of bewitching people prove that you deny God because God doesn't partake in bewitching. Praise the Lord, the brothers and the sisters everywhere you are in the world. You claim to know God, but you're still in the prostitution. This action over prostitution prove that you don't know God. Because God doesn't partake in prostitution. That is the wrong action that you're doing. So exactly that you don't know God because when you know God, you can't carry on doing prostitution. <coughs> Sorry. As you know God, you can't carry on doing wrong things that's hard. You claim to know God and you're still hurting, hurting discriminating other people. The action of hating and having jealousy here on the side prove that you don't know God because when you know God, as you know God, you can't continue being a racist or hating other brothers and sisters or have jealousy. Because the hate that in you, <coughs> defiling you in the eyes of God, Making you unpure. You are not unpure because you still in hurt. Praise the Lord, brothers and sisters. You still doing jealousy. 
you are still doing envy. This is why you are not clean. The envy, the hate, the jealousy defile you in the eyes of God. It's not a good thing because you are doing bad. Nothing is good in you by doing the wrong thing that you continue doing. I'm not the one who wrote to hear the scripture. You heard me reading from the book of Titus, chapter 1, verse 15 and 16. This message concerns all of us. When whoever is still doing wrong things, this message concerns you. So if I mean all of us, doesn't mean I'm doing wrong too. It's a message of God. It's concerning all of us. We have to loosen all of us. We have to focus on it. We have to do things accordingly to God's commandments. Accordingly to God's will, to God's like, what God like. This is why I mean the message concerns all of us. He's telling me and you who is pure and who is not pure. According to how the explanation is here about who is the pure and uh, who is not pure. For a pure, everything is pure. Whatever he does, the pure person, whatever he does is a pure. Because he is not in wrongdoing. His conscience is clean. Mind and the thinkings are clean of the person that is a pure. He doesn't think about harming, doing wrong things, going to break the shops of brothers and sisters outside there, going to break the doors of other brothers and sisters, they're going to destroy someone's property. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Thank you so very much. I love you, brothers and sisters. Let's continue sharing the message, this beautiful message in all four corners of the world. Let the message reach in America, Australia, other side of Africa, Asia. Europe, let the message reach all, all of brothers and sisters out there. And the God that we pray will continue being kind to all of us. Look here. They claim to know God, but uh, by their actions, they deny Him. They are detestable, disobedient, and unfit for doing anything good. You're going to claim to know God, but you're still going to go to the people who use some spirit, as a spirit, which are not from God. And you claim to know God. You're going to claim to know really God. And it's still going to... You're still going to... Uh, uh, to worship idol. You know. You're still going to worship idol. God is not there. In idol. So. The God that you claim to know... Is not is not the one that is reaching here. This one, when you know him, you can't do wrong again. You become pure. You are pure in the eyes of God, and you can't partake in any wrong action. Praise the Lord, the brothers and the sisters everywhere you are in all four corners of the world. Oh, Christ Jesus is so good, so good, so good, so good. God is so good every day and every moment. Oh, I love you, brothers and sisters. I'm your friend, Prophet Afonso Arali Chris, here at Pagetos Africa. Oh, continue sharing this beautiful message. As I said and always saying that I'm not here to judge anyone. I'm not here to judge any, any brothers and sisters. I'm just here to keep sharing the beautiful message of God. Oh, this is a good place to share the message of God. Africa App Media 24. Subscribe on YouTube. Follow on on Facebook and other social network and God will continue to glorify whatever we share here the beautiful message also you'll be receiving all the messages this is why I mean again and I'm reminding you to follow and subscribe on YouTube follow on Facebook subscribe on YouTube to keep receiving the beautiful messages while we post on uh, social medias in the name of Christ Jesus the Lord and Savior Let's pray together. 
tell God to help you to come out of the scenario setting to destroy hate in you, discrimination, racism, jealousy, you know, whatever wrong that you're still doing or you find yourself doing wrong and you don't understand yourself. Let's continue praying. God is so good. God is so kind. He will continue uh, helping all of us every time and every moment. Remember, must have too. I was in pure. I am pure today, but I was in pure. I fix with God too. Now I'm good with God. I can share the word of God with you. You know, so you too. I'm praying uh, you tomorrow to be pure too. To take out whatever which is uh, senseless, which is uh, uh, blocking the relationship between you and God. You have to do that. Oh, God is so very, very happy with you. I pray fix with God. Let's pray. <coughs> we say thank you so very much for the message, Holy Spirit. Oh, let this message reach more brothers and sisters in the world and change more friends. Come back to you. In your name, Christ Jesus, let many uh, hear uh, this beautiful message and uh, focus on how to become pure in your eyes again and again. Your name continue to be glorified, the Christ Jesus, Lord and the Savior. We pray to you. Amen. 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 <coughs> <coughs> Thank you so very much. Let's continue supporting each other and sharing the message all over the world. And the God will continue being kind to all of us. I love you. Your friend, Prophet Afonso Waralikris, if you want to share with me, uh, here's my number, plus 27, 84, 84, 800 in the name of Christ Jesus the Lord and Savior I love you a lot a lot a lot bye bye